Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's ICU, and today we have something absolutely breaking and urgent to discuss in the realm of jailbreaking. So be sure to give this video a huge thumbs up and share it around to tell people how important it is to avoid iOS 9.3.4. I cannot stress that enough. You guys need to stay away from today's brand new 9.3.4 release if you care about jailbreaking at all. So bringing over my iPhone 6 here inside of Settings General followed by Software Update, you'll notice that we do have an available update for iOS 9.3.4. And for the description, it reads, quote, iOS 9.3.4 provides an important security update for your iPhone or iPad and is recommended for all users. Now, the key word there is important because, of course, it isn't really important. The only thing that it does is just close the vulnerabilities exploited by the Pangu jailbreak. And, of course, the exact same thing applies for the combination PP Pangu tool. They're the same jailbreak, guys. So today's iOS 9.3.4 release effectively closed closes and patches the jailbreak. That's all it does. It's exactly the same as iOS 9.3.3 in all respects, except for that. It just closes the jailbreak. And I'm going to be completely blatant and honest with you guys. We are not going to get another jailbreak for iOS 9. This one for iOS 9.3.3 and lower was the last jailbreak for iOS 9. Developers have already shifted gears. They're going to focus on iOS 10. They already demonstrated that they could jailbreak iOS 10 beta 1 at MoSec 20. 2016, but a lot's going to change from that release until iOS 10 GM. We will know more soon. iOS 10 should be released to the public, hopefully within the first two weeks of September, because that's roughly when the next generation iPhone is going to be released, and Apple tends to kind of sync up those releases together. So just click that subscribe button below next to my channel name if you have yet to. That way I will keep you guys completely notified anytime there is new information in the world of jailbreaking and new tools are are released. Remember, there's not going to be an iOS 9.3.4 jailbreak. I'm just going to say that right now. The only way, and I highly doubt this, there's like a 2% chance of this happening. No, not even that, a 1% chance, is if Ty G was also working on an iOS 9.3.x jailbreak, and by some miracle, the exploits that they were utilizing were completely different from Pangu, and they happened to drop it. But that's probably not going to happen. Do not get your hopes up. Just avoid iOS 9.3.4 at all costs. The absolute best way to do that is to just stay vigilant when connecting your device to your computer and launching up iTunes. It will prompt you to update. Do not go through with it. I'm telling you guys, you cannot update to 9.3.4 and jailbreak, and you won't be able to. Of course, though, if you are on any other iOS 9 firmware, specifically in this case 9.3.3 and lower, you can still jailbreak using one of two methods, either the computer version or the on-device version, which of course just downloads the Chinese PP combination Pangu jailbreak app straight to your device at jailbreakme9.com. Visit it if you're on iOS 9.2 to 9.3.3. And of course, if you do want to utilize the computer method, there's a brand new jailbreak out today that essentially installs the app for one year or until April of 2017, utilizing that expired developer enterprise certificate. Again, that's brand new as of today. Then you can check out the video that I just released. Again, the link down below in the description will contain complete tutorials, every single guide I've released for how to jailbreak break iOS 9.3.x. So that wraps up this video, guys. Remember, just be sure to rate it up. That way, users can know to avoid iOS 9.3.4. And if you want to be updated even more frequently, again, just like me on Facebook and follow me on Twitter. And until next time, this is ICU signing out. Join the iCrack Your iDevice community on Patreon to help out the channel and to be featured in videos similar to these top contributors. Click the link on your screens now if you're on desktop or check below.